Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Wes. For those that are new, consider hanging out to the end. Everyone else, welcome back to another episode of Portal Craft. So what we did last episode was pretty much kind of get a feel for, you know, the, the area, kind of explain some things to you guys to kind of get everyone on the same page. And then we finished the portal, which was kind of the main goal here. Uh, so without any further ado, let's just jump right into this and go through the portal. Okay, so one thing, you know, I just thought of as I was I was kind of saying, let's go through the portal. I need to get some stone, actually, only because if you look at the, our number one, that's our bow, and our bow is practically dead, which it's it's not that hard to repair. We don't need wood or anything, which, although, you know, you would think, and it seems logical, all we have to do is we go into the, um, no, where was it? Is it mining? Yeah, there we go. Sharpening stone. Um, so... You know, it makes sense if it was for, you know, like a a, uh, a melee weapon or a spear or something. But in this case, we're just going to use the sharpening stone on our bow. Uh, usually just put it in your hotbar and then you just hit, for instance, in this case, 8, which we'll do. Mike was in the way. And then there you go. You know, our bow's back to brand new. So let's just jump into the portal. <laughs> Whoops, <laughs> went through it. But it's still gonna warp us anyways. Um, so this is another biome. It's completely different than the the, the Squire's Knoll, I think is what we were in. Um, this one's gonna be a surprise, so I won't exp I won't spoil uh what's gonna happen when we get through, or rather the biome on the other side. But let's see. Dusty Junction. Um Okay, well, that's new. Spiritual Aberration. Greetings, I'm a friend, the Spectral Knight, as we call ourselves. Okay. Once I protected, oh man, Ilesia from harm, now thanks to the Hollow Knight, I am but a shadow of its past. It is your destiny to succeed where I failed. Oh man, but he'd be like a ghost. It is your destiny to see where I have failed. Own your skills, explore, survive. Now he's a banshee or something. Be forewarned, two great beasts stand between you and your destiny. Each can be reached only by a special portal unlocked by a unique totem. Ah. Oh, he's not 3D. <laughs> Quite literally a shadow. Okay, so it's nighttime, which scares me because those that, you know, saw the first episode, you know that at nighttime, everything changes. The mobs change. It usually gets a little bit harder. But see, we have copper and we have a uh, ruby. I think that's what this is. Flame Ruby, yeah, okay. So this is what we need to kind of progress. Um, to upgrade our workbench, we need four copper ore, um, and then we just need some more copper in general uh, so that we can increase the damage of our bow, you know, maybe make a better bow, um, and stuff like that. I actually haven't made, or if I did, I forgot to check, what we actually needed to make the next set of armor and tools in regards to, oh, ding, bam. By tools, I mean like bow and then, yeah, obviously like a copper pickaxe. Uh, we need to find coal. That was another thing I forgot to mention. But that's why we have this episode, to hopefully find coal and some copper ore. At least that's what I'd like to get done this episode. So we're getting blue portal shards from mining, which is also something that's cool. I, I didn't know that, or maybe I've forgotten. Um, again, we need to find the portal. So for instance, to get to the next area... Uh, we have our kind of waystone, as I'm going to call it. You know, that's where we came in, and that's great and all. Uh, but that's not going to be where we then leave to go to the next area. We need to find a portal just like we luckily found in our first area that was just right by the actual, you know, waystone we came in and spawned on. Um, so every time you, you spawn into this world or this biome, and it'll always be at one of these waystones. So further on, we can get one ourselves. Um, it just, I think it's more expensive. So for instance, um, you know, you sometimes don't build your base right by the waystone. At least, you know, I, I do, I don't sometimes. And, you know, every time you die, you respawn there. So you'd have to run back, like, you know, at the cover of darkness. And you're like, ah, it's scary. Because, you know, there's a bunch of mobs. So when you get high enough, you just build them right at the center of your base or build a base around them. In this case, we're just going to leave this as is since it already has kind of like a old abandoned building or runes above it. Uh, I don't know if we need the rubies as uh, as a ranger. I know for a fact that when you are the wizard, that's actually how you upgrade your clothing. 
and your weapons. You need rubies. Um, quite a, a ridiculous amount, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but in this case, we're not that. So it seems pretty quiet. I know I did see one of the... Yeah, there you go. There we go. Got a flame knight over there or, you know, something. You know, he's, he's glowing bright orange. And he has a, a scythe that's also glowing, you know, hot. So we definitely don't want to mess with that. Um, oh, cactus give you water. So that's important for healing potions, which makes me think that maybe we should have brought some. Um, so I guess, you know, I'm scared because I'm used to playing like right up. And those, those uh, nighttime guys, they get pretty tough when you, especially when you have to run up at them. Um, but for, you know, sake of science and the video, let's see, can I make any minor healing potions? I can, I have some berries on me. Okay, so let's go ahead and then go back into our inventory. Oh, that's right, we can choose a talent. We're going to take bow specialist, so our bow does more damage. And then speaking of damage, we're going to increase our dexterity. That also gives us uh, more damage. Um, let's go ahead and just put two points in. And then, let's see, agility is how fast you run. Let's go ahead and put a point in there. Back to talents, we're fine there. Backpack, we want to make sure that we have these you know, active on our hotbar. Let's make it number three. Okay, so let's see about aggroing, hopefully just one of the hollowed knights. Oh, okay. So this is actually one of the bad guys that turned our poor friend into a shadow. Ow, well we critted there, you see, for 30, because we're getting some headshots. Oh, Alright, that wasn't as bad. So that's, the, over there, that's the, the turtle I was talking to about. See, they're immune while they're in the ground, um, and it can get kind of annoying. Sometimes, so we'll kind of just leave them as is. Let's go ahead and let's attack the uh, the grunt, the green horn grunt. Oh, see now he's trying to flee. So now when you're uh, again, when you're a warrior, you have to chase them down, and sometimes they're a little faster than you. All right, so I mean it's not as bad. This let's see if we can wake him up. There we go. So they do this weird yeah that thing, and it's like almost near impossible to. Um, What's the word? Dodge. Kind of just have to get out of their way. And while they do it, I believe they're immune. There we go. Okay, so it's not too bad. And hey, look, we have someone over here. The adventurer. Fellow adventurer, greetings! I don't know why everyone's voice is that. There's treasure everywhere, but no, uh, not so many places to spend it thanks to the Hollowed Knights. Look under the runes if you're bold enough. Yeah, I'm bold enough. Let's go ahead and I took it. Took it? I take it that this is what he must be referencing. As the ruins. Oh yeah, yeah, look, it's super dark in here, but there's a uh, there's treasure. I hope you guys can see this. Uh, treasure. Let's see what's in the big chest. Oh, oh man, there's a ton of stuff. Cotton, miner, mana potions, which we actually don't need. Uh, and some money. Okay. Where is the torch? There we go. Let's go ahead and craft one since we got some cotton, luckily from the. Um, from the, oh, there we go, there we go. Okay, so you hold it and it's also the same. From, let me not <laughs> shoot copper with our bow. Alright, um, as I was trying to say, we got the, the wool from the chest, or the cotton from the chest is what I was trying to say. So we have sand blocks, um, no luck on copper, or not copper. Um, oh man, it's dark. Coal. I don't remember if this biome has it or if we have to go to the next one, which I don't remember off the top of my head what it, the next one turns into. But we need coal. So let's see if we can take a quick look around. See if we can find, hopefully, we're hoping to find the portal. Um, and this is why I made the maps big. So, you know, it's somewhat of a challenge. Uh, uh, you know, rather than like I was explaining, you know, you come into a new world and then you look like to your right and you're like, oh, there's the portal. In this case, you know, it's it's somewhat of a challenge. We actually have to look for it to be somewhere. And once you find it, it's marked, so it's not like we have to, you know, remember quite exactly where it is. Uh, there's just way too many guys. We're going to have to fight some. Let's fight the Hollow Knight. He seemed to be pretty easy. Um, we seem to have some advantage over him. Oh, it's a fire scroll. I mean, I get what it is in practice. Deals fire elemental damage. Strong versus earth. Isn't the turtle earth? No, he's fire. What? Or oh, that's saying his bane is fire. Let's try it. Where's my six? Whoa. Let me not. 
Ow! He hits hard. Do something! Six, come on! Oh, no, 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 no! That's not good. That's not good. Stop! Untarget! Run! Oh, three. Hmm! Oh. I'm running to more and more... more things. So, this is bad. When you have two of them, it's not... Well, it's not good. But we can do that, I believe. I just gotta keep dodging. Oh, look! Items get in the way. No, no, no. Don't stand that close to it. <sighs> Dang, bushes are getting in the way. Okay, we're gonna get it. Just barely. Oh, we critted there. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Uh -huh. So, like I was saying, it it's it gets hard at night. Let's go ahead and just let's just attack everything now. Since I I realize we have healing potions, you know, we'll just if we get in a pickle, we'll just go ahead and just uh yeah, we'll just heal and run. Okay, so still no portal. Getting quite a few portal shards. We have quite a bit of copper on us. Um, that's not gonna matter until we get some coal. Oh, there's a mine. I wonder if there's any any copper down in the mine. Or, not copper. Coal. The other C word. Okay, let's see about... I know there's enemies all around us, but I need another sharpening stone, which is under this. Oh, I don't have stone. So I don't think this this biome has stone. Oh, oh, I lied. Okay, good. I hear that you can hear the armor, like the chainmail clinking of the, the Hollowed Knight. Okay. Oh, that's right. This has these bomb bats. There we go. That up. Inventory. Use. There we go. All right, Morden. Hello, Brave Knight. All the good stuff to keep down. Trust me, the risk is worth it. Okay. Oh, so these bomb bats, if you can think, they will blow up. In this case, we're looking out. Oh, oh, coal. But we got coal from the ah, the skeleton and the bomb bats. We don't want the bomb bats to blow up, but we also don't want to skeleton. Ah. Oh, the bomb bats drop charcoal. <laughs> That's actually not bad. Oh, is that coin? It is a coin, and that's a shard. Okay, straw blocks. Any coins in it? Yeah, there we go. That one had coins. And copper plated blocks, gray concrete blocks. More copper blocks. Oh, there's a big chest down there. Let's see. You know, instead of doing this in the dark, let's see about... Oh, no, I have a torch on me. Okay, good. Let's put that down there. Let's open the big chest. What's in it? <laughs> More? A bite trap? And then cotton. Oh, a bite trap. That's interesting. Is this a sign? Vermins! Is that it? That's... The end of this cave? There's no way. There has to be more somewhere, I would imagine. I sure hope so. But let's in the- Oh, what's that? Oh no, it's just- It's that. So let's get some bones. Let's- Let's go ahead and, um, go up and go back home, uh, only to kind of get set up for the- Oh! <laughs> oh. oh, sure. I don't know what I said. I'm not really work. Look, let perfect. Oh, oh! I already did it. In exchange for ten rubies. Complete quest. Sure. Oh, ding. Okay. Well, that was helpful. Oh, quest completed. A wealth of knowledge. Well, that's cool. Okay, so let's head back. Let's go ahead and find our way back. Um, I think I can. Oh, can I? Oh, yeah, I don't even need to be at the stone. I can just teleport whatever I want. Okay, I mean, that works. Um, I guess. Every portal needs a home. Or every portal light. You can design any island on your home map. You can designate, that's right. I always like this. There's another one I like. Um, it looks like this, but it's, it's a forest biome and it has a bunch of coal in it. Uh, so let's go ahead and... Oh, there we go. We'll have to clear this out. You know, make it look nice so that 
we don't have to constantly like run around these half mountains. Only because all you know, that's right. All our stuff is here. I forgot that we oh, no no part of that of having the oh that's right we leveled. Let's do two points and then agility again. We don't want the evil knights to get in. Okay, so crafting table time. No, that's backpack time. We want the crafting table to oh we need yeah archery station which we need copper we need a ton of wood okay let's get some wood and then i think we're gonna have to call this episode here after i get this wood and build these two tables so we'll have to come back next time to see the uh the effects of you know our gathering the coal and then this wood kind of see what it's all about uh, i hope you guys are enjoying these videos i heard i saw that the first one kind of had a good reaction so i'm hoping that you know this one will have the same that people will still enjoy it. So now that we are have this leveled up, we can go ahead and we can then actually make the archery station. We're going to need a furnace, which means we need stone. All right, so let's go ahead and let's just throw down. Let me throw the archery station somewhere. Uh, where did it go? There it is. And then I can kind of, we can kind of see what we're, we're working towards next time. Go ahead and just throw it down there and use and then weapons. So we have the copper slingshot, the copper mastery bow and the copper crossbow. But you can see we need scales, um, dust, copper bar, uh, more scales and stuff like that. Oh, but we also need to be level six. Interesting. Oh, but the copper bow also is a fire bow. That's interesting. We'll have to keep that in mind and kind of, oh, look, this gives you health regen. I'll have to keep that in mind. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in to this episode of our Portal Night Adventure. Hopefully you guys are having a good day. I know I am. And until next time, guys, as always, keep it real.